Hi, I'm Rob Melville. I'm the design director for McLaren Automotive. The point of inception, it can start in different ways. It can come from what we have, a product steering committee, where we talk about future ideas, future opportunities. But of course, in there, different people from different teams present those ideas. So it can come from engineering, it can come from design, it can come from a conversation around the coffee machine. But essentially, that seed can start in a number of ways. The products which are really game changers, that they take a bit more work to gain traction and get people to buy into it. So for example, things um, within the Ultimate series where they have a very unique, distinct character, and you go from Senna, this road, ultimate road legal track car, at the 100 meter sprinter versus the Speedtail, which is all about low drag, it's all about accelerating, not 300 kilometers per hour, as quickly as possible in, in supreme luxury and comfort. And that's like the Olympic swimmer. So their physiques are very different. And as a product, they're very unique. We obviously were sketching to a brief. We've got a set of attributes for the car. How many people, how much luggage space, is it a supercar, is it a GT car, etc. We're sketching to that brief at this point. Maybe after a month or you know, two, two weeks to four weeks in, we're narrowing down the number of ideas. So after lots of sketches, we'll choose the best six exterior, the best four interiors. We then start to do six scale models on the exteriors. This can be a combination of clay work and alias, which is some software where digital sculptors create the designs on the computer. Through that process, we go from six down to four, down to two, down to one. Physical foam models, full size. We can sit in them, experience with, with VR headsets as well. And then finally, we go with one. For anyone who sees the final product on the road that first time, it is absolutely amazing because it doesn't matter how good the models are, it's never the same as seeing the car in the carbon. There's something about having the real materials, the way the light reflects off the body. It's almost like taking a lion out of the cage in the zoo and seeing it walk along the plains in the savannah. It's, it just feels like wow. And it's supremely rewarding because of that.